Good morning for Morning Mastery. It is Why Wednesday. We're here to connect and share with warriors like yourself committed to your life of growth and mastery. Woof! It has been an insane two weeks. I feel like I've been um, like stepped into like this vortex in some other like universe and time and craziness. So many things have happened. I feel like talking to you for like two hours to share out of my total excitement. But studies show that I'll lose you after two to four minutes, unfortunately. But that's okay because we're gonna chat a lot in the upcoming days about what's going on, including posting the Thanksgiving video tomorrow. On this Why Wednesday, though, um, I'll get more into the stories as we go. Um, suffice it to say um, that totally insane things happen when we unlock our identity. So much of what we do, so much of what we see in front of us is all rooted in who you think you are. And, and your why begins with your identity of yourself. And so my challenge for you on this Why Wednesday is to really unlock more of yourself and your identity. And there was, I, I realized for the last 15 years of my life, I was hiding from the world. And, and I did it intentionally, by the way, because I wanted to be there for my children in certain ways, and I wanted to be a dad, and I wanted to create freedom and time for myself. I wanted to coach their teams and be super involved. And now I'm shifting my identity to really play a huge game on a national and global level. Uh, truth in, in helping people and impacting people to be an example of possibility. One of the things that we're saying now related to our mastery movement is that it's about influencers, me and others, influencing influencers to merge ecosystems so one plus one equals a trillion to make the world an even greater place. That's a lot larger vision than paying the bills. That's a lot larger vision than just kind of getting by. And like this upcoming week, and it's, it, our identity shapes how we think about things. My beloved cousin, Scott Bastek, is gonna be running um, in the San Francisco Marathon. And we're chatting it up at his mom, uh, my Aunt Carol's 70th birthday. And he's like, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm targeting uh, running two hours and 30 minutes. Two hours and 30 minutes for a marathon. He's 32 years old. He has a job, he has a career, he's brilliant. He went to uh, Georgetown, he went to the London School of Economics, and he's doing incredible things. And still, he's trying to run two and a half hour marathons 10 years out of running at Georgetown. And that's a part of his identity. That's just who he is. So who are you and did you select that identity or was it selected kind of for you? Did you let people beat you down? And if so, step up, right? Find that deeper part of you. Write your more powerful why. Whatever game you're playing, life is about growth no matter what we've achieved and accomplished. A part of it is to celebrate, reflect, love, connect, absolutely, especially as we come up on Thanksgiving. But a part of it also for our true fulfillment inside is to grow. And I'm not talking just about money, but it could be partially. It could be your career, it could be improving the relationships you have, the love you feel, deepening your connection with family members, and it could be all of the above, all of it. So in this Why Wednesday, the challenge is to really look at who you are and what type of huge game you're playing, and tomorrow I'll explain to you how I ended up in a picture backstage with me, Tony Robbins, two-time Super Bowl winner David Deal, and then got a personal voicemail from Tony and other things going on. So we'll talk more about that on Thanksgiving because I'm super thankful for that. And especially on Thanksgiving where Tony Robbins fed millions and millions of people, I think it's a good day to tell that story. It's Why Wednesday. Have an awesome day.